A very good morning to everyone. Today we have a demo on largest lymphatic organ that is known as spleen. It is present in left hypochondrium. It can be wedge shaped, triangular or tetrahedral shape. Measurement is 1 into 3 into 5 inches. We have the external features. So it is having two ends. This is posterior end which is pointed. Same how this is known as the anterior end which is broad. At posterior end it is facing upwards, backwards and medially. Anterior end it is facing downwards, forwards and to the left. It consists of three borders. Let us know the three border. This is known as the superior border which consists of the splenic notch. So, this is superior border which is splenic notch. Same how we have the inferior border. So, this is inferior border and we have one more border that is known as intermediate border. So, this is intermediate border. Now, we have the surface. So, we have the visceral surface and we have the diaphragmatic surface. So, this is known as the diaphragmatic surface. Imagine that the index finger is known as the ninth ribs. So, this is the ninth ribs. Middle finger is known as the 10th ribs and the ring finger is known as the 11th ribs. Now, let us keep this spleen on 9, 10th and 11th ribs. It means it is having relation with the diaphragm as well as with the 9, 10th and 11th ribs. We have visceral surface. So, this is known as the superior border again. I repeat, this is known as the superior border. This is intermediate border. Between the superior and intermediate border, we have gastric impression for the stomach. Same how we have the inferior border, this is inferior border, same how this is intermediate border. So, between the inferior and intermediate border, it is related with left kidney with the leno renal ligament. It means the renal impressions. Same how there is impression that is known as gastric impressions. It means it is related with the stomach with the help of gastrosplenic ligament. Let us know the other impressions. Now, in this area, there is a pancreatic impressions. It means it is related with the of pancreas as well as with the colic impression means left colic flexures. This is known as the hilum of the spleen which consists of the splenic vessels. It means splenic artery, splenic vein as well as the, the nerve supply. Let us know the clinical aspect that is known as splenomegaly, enlargement of the spleen that is due to cirrhosis of liver, kalajar. Next is splenectomy that is removal of the spleen and third is known as Keher signs that is if there is a problem with the, the spleen or due to rupture of the spleen, there is a pain on the left shoulder or near the left hypochondrium. So, this is all about the spleen and its external features. Thank you.